It was just a complete, take your life as you know it, turn it completely upside down. So all of a sudden one day you're just like this kid, oh, we have homework to do, um, I have dance class to go to, and then you know within a couple of days, everything just changed. We found out, oh no, we have cancer. Um, what are we gonna do? That was just a, it took a real examination of your feelings and, and how you dealt with things. And, and, and you think that you've dealt with hard things your life and all of a sudden something like this comes up and the rest of that was piece of cake. Not to sound gross, but you know, you, there's so many times that during her chemo, I mean, she would throw up every two to three hours for five days straight, it never stopped. And the best that you can do is make sure there's a bucket there to give her right away so it's not gonna get all over herself. What it was like when I found I was going to Disney World, it was awesome. Knowing that you are getting considered for a wish in itself is kind of powerful because then they're, they're, that's another hope that you get. Um, and you can see the, them talking about that. It's a, it's a new subject to talk about. It's not, we're not talking about cancer. We're talking about, oh, if I get this wish, I'm going to do this. Getting in the limo for our Make-A-Wish trip, they'll tell you this forever. The limo ride was the most awesome thing. First of all, the limo ride was like the best thing ever. Uh, of course, like a Taylor Swift song, the Shake It Up song came up and they're all like, look at, they're dancing in the, the limo and having a great time. You know, of course, they're like standing up and going, woo, in the limo. The hidden power is actually the buildup of the Make-A-Wish trip to come. It was the talking about the trip that was coming. It was talking about the plans and all the cool things that we would see prior to it as, as opposed to talking about what my cancer treatment was. So it was all that, there's a special power in that and that was, that was pretty incredible. When I was in treatment, it was so cool to be looking forward to it. It was almost as if it was the light at the end of the tunnel. It keeps you motivated, you know, you're getting sick and throwing up and you're just looking forward to, you know, your trip. I did firsthand get to witness that not only does medicine cure you, but the, the mind can cure you too. Um, and having those positive thoughts and those things to look forward to is a, a treatment in itself. Every now and then you do a second look and like, oh wow, we're actually like eating dinner together or she made the dance team again or she's jumping around at recess just like all the other kids are doing. And those are like those moments that are just the precious like, wow, I'm starting to realize that she is, everything's gonna be okay. And just remember, make a wish, we'll always have that wish just waiting for you. And you can always, after treatments and stuff, always have that fun time. It's amazing.